Prepare the required tools. Polish and handle the original model. Choose the right part to mold line. Pile up the clay under the mold line. After fixing the clay, dig in the holes evenly on the clay to make latch. Brush detergent or soapy water evenly on the surface of the mold, so that the mold could separate with the silicone rubber mold easily. According to the complicated structure of the size of the products, we choose the type of silicone rubber which has low viscosity and hardness. Mix silicone rubber and curing agent evenly. Then put them into the vacuum container. To pump the air out of the silicone rubber. After vacuum pumping, brush the first layer of silicone rubber evenly on the mold. Brush the second layer of silicone rubber till the first one is cured, about 15 minutes. After brushing the second or the third layer of silicone rubber. Cover the gauze. When the silicone stops flowing, the gauze can increase the tension and strength of the mold. Make the raising out mold after the silicone rubber mold is solidified. Paint a layer of raising evenly first, and cover a layer of glass fiber. Then paint a layer of raising. Separate the mold till the resin solidified completely. After gypsum cured, take out the out mold and trim silicon mold and gypsum out mold. The process is done. The silicon rubber mold can be used into production after 24 hours, and it should be stored in ventilated, cool. And dry place.